we had a tank. I knew I should have gone to law school. Can't run. Do I have a choice? Not really. All right, let's go. Affiliate station KXT in San Francisco now has a picture. Yes, see, there it is. Police and troops are trying to maintain orderly evacuation of the nation's capital. God, what is that? Oh, it's true that we should leave the city. No, the roads are jammed. Oh, Stanley. You heard the president. So far, there's no indication. You mean you come and help? Sure. That low pulsing hum. I'd kind of like to be with you, just in case. Now, our live coverage. Sheva, Shish, five. The Secretary General is coming out. He's indicating to the UN troops to lower their weapons, and they're doing so. It's completing its turn now, and something in. Four in The Secretary General. That's one brave man, I need to. And now is disappearing hmm. through the opening. They have come in peace, and that they wish to honor. All the covenants of our united nations. Distance from the star you call Sirius, some 8.7 light years from Earth. Fantastic. This yeah. is the first. Now that we have established contact, we would like to meet with individual governments to make requests for certain. Oh, Mama's dad. He's the UN up there. Did you the hear? Group, they said Mike, Mike Donovan. Donovan. Look, there he is. I can't believe it. Good luck. And now the shuttlecraft is lifting off from the roof of the United Nations building. Good luck. Hey, for those of us accustomed to the likes of Close Encounters or Darth Vader's futuristic Star Destroyer... What's in the rest of the other half? You see? Another close up oh, oh. <laughs> And this refinery here in Los Angeles will be the first plant in the U.S. to officially begin work with the visitors. I think they look real snappy in those uniforms. <laughs> Then the group of visitor technicians moved inside. <laughs> she didn't talk much. Seemed real shy. He told me that their planet's much like Earth. In response to overwhelming questions and requests by young adults around the world, the visitor's supreme command... Lost. Oh. English. Not... Well, to me. Learned Arabic. We've done research that shows your people have a lot of confidence in you. You have. You're trusted, respected. It's 300 degrees below zero down, down there. Here. There's no way a human being could. Get him out. Compromising by sucking up to him? Not sucking up to anybody. <laughs> Don't you see it's the perfect opportunity? Mm. Over here, over here, over here. Mm. 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 He just hasn't found his niche yet, that's all. Unlike others, we couldn't mention. See, Dad, check it out. He's got a squad vehicle. Yeah. And the action figure, the Supreme Commander? What is it? Well, it's just something I picked up off a squad vehicle. A real Why not do something of your own? Whatever happened to your college Please. plans? Please. Don't start. You really love him, don't you? Does he know? I'm just a piece of lab equipment. I know, and did you see his eyes? Me? They're gorgeous. My life is over. Did I startle you? Uh, no, no. I'm Brian. Right. Hey, hero! Billy! Hello. Hello, I'm sorry I called you a stupid ape. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, no, no. Yeah. As scores of medical scientists around the world came forward to admit they had been approached or actually confessed that they were part of the conspiracy. The visitor, Supreme Thank Commander, you. John, had this to say. The visitors were shocked to learn of this conspiracy. That's what I said in 1938, back in Berlin. But this is different. Is it? Supreme Commander wants to make it clear that while he's sure all scientists around the world aren't part of the conspiracy, 
It is still just... I mean, they know that I'm a biochemist and a med student. No, no. How could it be you? It's a tape we shot of him at that big science fair last year. I remember when I had him autograph that book for my old... Yesterday, he used, used his, his left hand, hand. so he's ambidextrous. Oh, no, no, he's not. And neither is de Vivier. I checked. I'm not very good at this. Hi, Hi, how are you? Good. Her father's an anthropologist, huh? You didn't know? No. Come on. I didn't know it. I can't come on. I can't get my foot up. Come on, I got you. Pleases me to serve our leader with whatever it's minor much, talent. Much tougher than we bargained for. To convert the ball would take forever. has got a tape that's supposed to knock our socks off. We've lost my bell. We've what? Somebody's pulled AT&T right out from under us. There's they something. Thousands have been wounded, and this is we're fearful that there will be more attacks. I'm going to the hospital. Friends, units everywhere. All right. We anticipate this crisis will pass relatively quickly. In the meantime, friends... And these attacks by I... scientists, conspirators, are still continuing sporadically and violently around the world. I can't work for you no more. It's the other people that I work for. They know that I work for you, and they don't like it. But why should the other people? Oh, fair. What? Yeah, I wrecked it up. Said I was just a dirty little scientist kid. I should have seen him when Another I Another biochemist. Uh, Phyllis, you remember her? Well, uh, she didn't show today. The no Supreme Commander oh, urges you. I'm so you. tired of her face and only hearing one side of what's going on. Well. The oh. truth is the truth. We're not scientists, and it's not like I said anything. But you were very critical of her and of them, of the newspapers, everything. Pam. The truth. Not only on television, but they've got the papers, too. We are under martial law. And paranoia. Everyone I know is... We're not the only scientists. ones who want to fight this thing. She's right. Now, what we've got to do is find the others. <laughs> it is you, uh, buenos noches. Tony, cut the... We, uh, we've been having trouble with the phone, Stop Uncle. Oh, that guy. Come on, hold on. Oh. Hey, get that guy. Daddy, how are we going to get through here? Are we going to fight? No. Now where are we going to go? Who's going to help us? Lynn and Stanley never use this place. And a fugitive, I take it, which would make them doubly dangerous. They have to stay. Don't you see, Stanley? They have to stay. Or else we haven't lined a thing. You don't believe me, do you? Thanks. Very glad to see you. You look very pretty. Is he still a virgin, do you think? Who? Ryan. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They're trying to steal him for a lab, and they shot him. What? The doc? Steal his stuff? Oh, oh, some stuff, man. You go come to me first, right? I'll show you how to do it, man, so you don't get... Oh, yeah, shorty. The other one can die. He could die, but... Oh, damn it, Ben. Damn it. You understand? For victory. I lost my mom and dad. But Sean's mom grabbed me. She pulled us into the house. I took them. Everybody in the square. There's a lot of shouts and crying. When I came to visit Sean, I brought him something. What is it? It's a key. A toast. To my engagement. 
But she's gone away. Not that far away, and I want her. Uh, just like I wanted this champagne. Come oh, on! Stop it, Daniel! Oh. Daniel! Yeah, but they'll grant my family amnesty, right? Just like we arranged. Who is this family that's in hiding anyway? Was being smuggled out. What should I do? It's okay. All right, let's move it out then. Who took my father? They said arrested? But they promised amnesty. They said. Yeah, it looks like he had somebody hidden back here, but they're uh, gone now. My superiors decided to take your family in for questioning. But they'll be home soon. They will. Brian! I'm glad you like it. And I'm proud to have you in my unit. Over here. Come with extra batteries. They're rechargeable, I think. Clever those Japanese. Look out. prepared so we can bring down all of our equipment from the mountain camp. We're trying to make things livable. Please, trust your instincts. Trust yourself as much as everybody else trusts you. I always thought you thrived on challenges. I would have thought you'd find the difficult game far more interesting. I don't think even you, with all of your abilities, Never turn this head of We're going to get you out of here. You're what? It's very dangerous, but not more dangerous than what would happen if you stayed. No, just tried to me. talk her into converting me. It's impossible it's that I'm staying. Mike, I'm not leaving without him. Mike, it's too late for Tony. Mike, conversion is a very difficult and time-consuming operation. Mom! Oh, lots of luck. I'll never be able to stretch enough. How many more of you are there? Not enough. Not nearly. And there's going to be one less if you don't hurry. What happens next? No, I don't mind the duty down there. You hardly ever see them out alone. Yeah, and Julie really wants a chance to study one of them up close, you know, find out what makes <laughs> You're a bunch of stupid bozos. You call me a sympathizer? Kid, well, I ought to take those bandages and shove them right down your throat. Huh? Uh, up to 60 million years ago, the reptiles ruled the Earth. Then, bam, a meteor. A big one, punished a hole right through the crust that sent up dust. You know what we ought to do? We ought to define our overall plan of resistance. Right, right. Now, let's make a list of targets to consider. Hey. Robin? Another Maxwell. Ah, uh, Brian. Good to see you. I need your help. Ah, of course. Where, where do you know of its existence? We need to find its location. I can't do anything about it. I... I'm awfully sorry for your daughter. Hey. It can be done quite easily, without harm being brought to anyone. What, four o'clock tomorrow? Brian! Oh. Four o'clock? I don't know we're there. OK, one o'clock then. Followed by our main assault against the armory at two. I'd hate to lose me, too. Good luck. down in the hold. You've been there? Yeah. You are here to take the water. We're in an 
another ship like this one. There's another basic shortage on our planet. Tony. What are you? A friend. It's very, very dangerous for me here now. What does he look like a Sunday afternoon in Disneyland? I'm sure Barbara was scared and Tony too. Hell. Hang on. It's not four o'clock, you lied! You did lie to me! Would you learn how to fly? to understand that we may have to sacrifice those thousands to save millions, even billions. Look. You know, when I was a kid, there was a woman who taught me what was right and what was wrong. I wonder what ever became of her. The lightning struck here once already. Believe me, they won't look here again. We can't. The only... My father left it for us. Read it. Enjoying with the others till we've become a blinding light. Our spirits will be with you always. We have to help. Or else we won't have learned to think. <laughs> 